Night of football for a single father and his young children almost turned deadly. Here they are at the Georgia Tech Clemson game. They had no idea that when they would leave the stadium, the 11 year old Boy Scout you see on this monitor right here would be hit by a car and the driver would just keep going. Just listen to this little boy. Words no 11 year old should have to say from a hospital bed with a broken leg in two places. His father recorded this message. I'm feeling better right now. I please, please, if you can, find her, who did this to me, and what they've done. Monday night, the father, along with his 11 year old boy and seven year old daughter, were crossing the street outside Mercedes Benz Stadium a little before the game ended. And that's when they saw the car. It flew down the hill and there was nothing anybody could do it. He tried to get out of the way. Luckily, he was able to get away out, out of the way enough that all it got was his leg. Despite months of recovery, this family is grateful for those who stepped in to help. A random Clemson fan who happened to be a nurse stopped to help us too. And I, if anybody knows who she is, I would love to find her and tell her thank you. And a message for the driver. You hurt my son. You know, I'm not mad at you but I would like for you to come and admit to what you did wrong and come forth and you know own up to it. So here's what we know. A witness gave police a partial plate for a black sedan, possibly a Cadillac. As of tonight's newscast, we have not heard yet from APD. So tomorrow, Kane will start physical therapy. There are pictures of him here in the hospital. He has a long way to go. So we posted a GoFundMe link on WSBTV.com. Wendy wishing him the best. Of course, we sure do.